All right, good morning. I am here at Dollar General. Um, I am on a diet, I'm doing lower carb, so I needed eggs. <laughs> um, I eat cheesy eggs almost every morning. Last week I lost three pounds. Since December 5th, which is when I had my little boy, um, I've lost all of my baby weight plus 25 pounds, um, which I'm very happy about. But I needed something for breakfast and I'm out of eggs. So I'm going into Dollar General to get eggs, but also I want to check out their Easter stuff. Eggs with, with oatmeal with yours? All right, so I went into Dollar General for um, Easter items. I wanted to decorate my house for Easter. But the Dollar General I went into didn't have any Easter stuff in. Uh, I was very disappointed. But before I went in, I checked their digital coupons um, and they have a dollar off of their brand of wipes. So this pack was $4 and some change before the coupon. So it brought it down to $3 and some change. So this is just over a dollar per pack, which I thought was really good. We always need wipes, so I'll buy them even if we don't. Um, and they had all of their winter clothes marked down 50% um, off. So I bought this. This was $6.25 after the markdown. I'll do a whole vlog on what's going in their Easter baskets. Just because I hate buying the pre-made Easter baskets, I feel like it's a bunch of fluff for the money. It's a basket with a bunch of paper and a few pieces of candy. Uh, I did. I love to shop at Kirkland. That is my favorite home decor store. Um, I'm not sure if they're all over the United States, so if you don't know what Kirkland's is, it is a home decor store. But I saw this sign and I absolutely loved it. And for $4, like I don't think I could find anything in Kirkland's like this for $4. But it's a coffee sign, so I'm going to decorate my coffee bar. Alright, so this is my coffee bar. I have hot tea, I have coffee. I'm hoping to get an espresso machine soon. Um, I'm gonna have one of these, this size filled with hot chocolate. Um, so there's something for everyone, hopefully. Um, so I got this sign and as you can see, my background is tile. So I'm not sure if I'm just gonna sit it. Um, I kind of don't like that, but I was thinking I could get some of those command strips and just hang it right there. And I think that would probably be the best option. Something else I found, which I've been needing, is this basket, it goes inside of your cabinet. So I can put like my dish soap and my sponges and all of that. And I'll show you exactly what I plan on doing with it. This is what I did with my cabinet shelf. Um, I have my sponges that I don't use. My little boy still takes a bath in the sink. So I have all of his bath stuff. I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna put here, but that's just an idea. You have three pieces together already, all by yourself? Oh, you have way more. You're doing such a good job. Everest to tell. So cool. It has been one of those Mondays where I'm really just catching up on laundry and cleaning the little bit. Um, so I need a break. <laughs> Does anyone else need snacks in the car right now? Tonight we are having a baked chicken, rice, and broccoli casserole. Um, it is a buffalo ranch recipe. Um, and I really just kind of threw it all in one pan. So if you like to see that recipe, comment below. All right, so I am about to make a diaper caddy. Um, if you've been following my vlog, you know that when I had my youngest son, we didn't have this house. Um, so he, I haven't done him a room. He's been sleeping in the room with us. Um, but because I don't have a place to put his stuff, packs of wipes keep missing. <laughs> Um, I opened a brand new one and the very next day it's gone, knowing fully that they haven't been used. So I'm about to show you what I'm putting in my diaper caddy and I hope it can give you some good, helpful tips. All right, so the first thing you need is some um, type of basket 
or something to carry all of the products that you need. Um, I wish this one had a handle. So if you can find something that you like that has a handle, that'll probably be best. Um, but I'm gonna put an entire pack of diapers just because it fits in this basket so nicely. Um, I do have an open pack of wipes, but I think for this purpose, I'm gonna add the full pack of wipes in here because it fits nicely down in there. Um, and another thing I feel like I need is diaper cream. I still have this in here, so I'll probably take it out and add it just so it's not taking up so much space. If I can get it out. So here's the diaper cream. I'm gonna add that in there. And then I always feel like in the middle of the night is when my son pees through his diaper the most. Um, whether it be pee or poop, it escapes. So I'm gonna add an extra set of pajamas just to keep down in here. Not something I'll use all the time, um, but it's nice to have close by, especially when you have those kinds. And he also sleeps in a swaddle. Um, so for those times when he pees through or poops through, it would be nice to have an extra swaddle. So I'm gonna put that in my diaper caddy. And we lose passies a lot too. <laughs> so I'm gonna add passies. I'll probably take these out, but just to show, um, I'll add the pacifiers in. Um, and one more thing, um, typically when I'm changing my son is when I notice all the stuff up his nose. So I'm gonna add some boogie wipes. That way they're here when I need them. And the only thing I'm missing is the changing pad. So as soon as I can find that, I'm gonna add that as well. So that way everything's together and he can just throw it back in the basket and it should help it keep keep it all together better. Um, at least I'm hoping. So hopefully that'll help.